Hey everyone, I'm Sarah with Fisher Price Ranch. Please, first off, don't forget to subscribe. So, I've been trying to catch all these births on video, but the girls are not working with me. However, I rushed home from work. Um, Mama has been in labor for hours with no, um, no progress. Brandon's been here, but he still isn't sure when to go in. So unfortunately, um, I got here. The sack was already popped on the baby. And I reached in, and I found a foot, so I started pulling on it. Reached in, found another foot, come and breach. Monster baby! Oh my god, it's huge. Um, I'm going to say at least close to 10 pounds. So, anyway, given our short break, but I ran in to grab my video camera so I could show you guys. And we'll catch the rest of the birth on video. So here we go. <clears throat> Alright, so she's out here in the barn. Brandon's out here helping clean up the baby. It's a ginormous buck. Go figure. Gorgeous boy, though. He's a wrecker son. And she's still very big, so I'm sure she has at least one or two more. But look how big that baby is. He's a monster. So we'll get him weighed up after she's done with labor. But that's our first one. Alright you guys, well it's been just over half an hour since this kid was born and she still hasn't had anything. So we're going to go ahead and go in because um, I just stuck a finger in and I was able to feel a bubble a little while ago. Um, but she still hasn't progressed so we're going to go ahead and go in. She's our typical doe that gives us a little bit of trouble and I just don't want to risk anything. So um, Brandon's going to go ahead and hold on to her while I go in. She's actually having a contraction, so we may wait for just a second and see if she pushes. So we're just using a cooking oil just to lube up. Okay, him out of the way. And she's not going to like this.
Good job, Mom. Now we'll give her a little bit of time and see if she has a third in there, which is always possible. But with the size of him, she's a pretty decent size. We'll, uh, I'll give her a little bit, but we'll probably go back in and just make sure that there's no more hiding. Here, Mom, don't worry about that, okay? Take care of your daughter now. Yeah, look! You got two! Good job, Mom! Good job! And thank goodness, this girl, she had almost no udder. We did that feed change that I talked about in the last video, and her udder got huge. So she has way more than enough milk now. So that makes me feel a lot better. Good job, Mom! Good girl! Yeah, good girl! Alright, so it's been a little bit... Sorry, you guys can't see me. Um, but we're going to go ahead and just go and check just to see if she's done with just the twins. Or if there's another one that we're waiting on. Let's do this one more again, Mama. One more time, Mama. <laughs> I know. It's all right, Mama. I'm just making sure you ain't got no more. Easy, Mama. I know. Now you're going to push me. Oh, don't really push. Oh, she don't. It's all right. No, she is done. Okay. No more babies. All right, Mama, we'll leave you alone now. All right, so when I went in, all I felt was like, um, I guess it feels like jello. A yeah, maybe like a really thick jello with a bunch of little balls on it. And what those are is part of the afterbirth. So she is done with twins. Alright, so now that we got the kids out, we're going to get them weighed. Make sure they're nursing okay. As you guys can see, we did get snow last night. It was negative 3 degrees this morning. Hi Bonnie, we're still waiting on her to pop. Oh, she's already got him outside. Sometimes some does are pretty protective. And we've got Myrtle over here that's hanging out and Mama doesn't like it. But they learn to stay away from the moms that aren't theirs. So both kids are nursing. All right, you guys. Well, I hope this was helpful. I hope that you guys were able to hear me okay and kind of see what was going on. Uh, we got two very healthy kids, nine pounds and seven pounds. So uh, anyway, thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time.